Oh, this is the freaking weird box thing. All right, we're going through still. All right, this is weird. Whoa! Whoa! Yo, what's up, CDs and CDs? My name is CDang, and welcome back to another Roblox video, guys. Now, today, I just so happen to be scrolling through Roblox, just looking for some more games to play as per usual, guys. I always just like to explore the website and wonder if I could become Ariana Grande. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> but today, I happen to go ahead and search C Dang and the, you know, uh, I don't know, the search bar, I guess, under games to see if there are, you know, any games for me to play that you guys have possibly and potentially made for me. And I happen to notice there was something that really caught my eye. A, a couple actually scary games, guys. And I saw this and I was hyped, bro. C Dang Nightmare Adventure, Chapter 1, Bugs Fixed. And it says, C-Dang has a nightmare about one of his haters wanting to kill him and makes his fan thinks he's Splank and wants to escape. I hope C-Dang will play it. Well, today, your dreams will be coming true. And it's actually so cool to see just my picture right there. And then there's some kind of creepy zombie and then a bunch of ketchup all over the place. If you know what I mean. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and give that a thumbs up real quick. Wait, did... Oh, I have to play it first. Well, I'm going to go ahead and play, and then I'm going to give you a thumbs up. But without further ado, guys, let's go ahead and jump into this scary game that literally has me in it, man. It's, it's based around me, man. That's freaking awesome, guys. Let's go. I'm freaking hyped. All right, guys. So it looks like we are all loaded into the game now. It is me, and then there's this guy standing here. I don't know what his deal is. He looks like he's, 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 he's dressed up pretty nice and chilling and stuff like that. It's all good. It's all cool. So let's go ahead and go into this house. Oh, what the heck? He's here again. This might be the freaking the, the, the horror scary guy, bro. I don't freaking know what to expect, man. I'm scared, actually. I'm actually scared he's going to be in one of these rooms again. Do these doors open? All right. Oh, my gosh. What the heck? Whoa. What the heck is that, bro? It looks like freaking ink, bro, from Benny and the Ink Machine. There's just... Oh, my gosh. There's some weird stuff going on outside, bro. Uh, what was that? Is that something out there? Did I see something? I don't know what that was, bro. I have no idea. I don't know. I think that guy might be a good guy. Just judging from the picture of the game, it looked like we should be good. But I'm not 100% sure. We got the computer there. Uh, ooh, this door is not... Is, I'm always so scared when doors don't open. Because I just have a feeling that, like, there's going to be something behind them. Alright, we're good. This house is fine. I don't know what that guy is. But like I said, the picture of the game looked like there was some kind of zombie. So that guy, like, might just be chilling like a villain or something. Let's open this garage door. Alright, nothing in here, guys. Alright. Ugh. Is this door open? I don't think it does. All right, so this house seems to be clear, but I did think I saw something outside, although I'm not 110% sure. Oh, what the heck? Oh, this, I can't pa bypass this area. What the heck? What is that out there? What is that? I can't even get out of here. What the heck, bro? How do we get out of here, man? How do we get out of here? I can't, bro. I freaking can't. Oh my gosh, dude. I'm freaking trapped in this house, bro. I want to get out. What if I reset? Maybe if I reset, I can go out there. Because I saw a couple things, like, out in the distance. And I feel like maybe I'm supposed to be in this area. But it's just, like, the... Whatever the... Mon it might have been a monster back here. Let me see. Can I go through here? Oh, yeah, I can. All right, so I think I'm supposed to go through here. Oh, that makes sense now. All right, so I thought I saw something over in that area. But I guess not. Um, oh, there's something over that way, too. But I can't go that way. So judging by that, I'm supposed to go through this creepy ink, uh, darkness goo stuff and into this mountain here and this i feel like this is making me slower but maybe that's just me thinking of bending in the ink machine that might be it all right we're going through this really creepy whole thing i don't know what this is bro i don't know what this is oh what is that oh this is the freaking weird box thing all right we're going through still all right this is weird what the heck whoa whoa Oh, that actually scared me! Stop it! Ah! Uh, what the heck? Oh my god, there's ketchup all over the place and this girl is just freaking stabbed, bro. Oh my god, are you okay? You're floating in the ketchup abyss. That actually scared me so bad, bro. Oh my gosh, bro. All those unexpected jump scares, you know? You might think, oh, that, that was a dumb jump scare. No, it wasn't, man, because it scared me. The whole point of a jump scare is to scare you, even if it was, like, random. <laughs> oh my gosh, I hate that feeling after you get jump scared. You just got the tingles in you, bro. That's what I have right now. I got the tingles going through my veins right now. All right, here we go. We're going over onto this ledge thing. Going over to this, like, lava pit thing. I don't know what this is, but it's kind of scaring me right now. All right, here we go. We're walking on sunshine. Yeah, yeah. It's time to feel good. All right, presumably, we're supposed to continue going on to this path here that we've been 
made to go on. Let's let's stay in first person here just to make it a little scarier for myself. I'm scared there's gonna be something that pops out on one of these corners. Am I supposed to climb up this? Well, maybe I'm not supposed to. Oh, there we go. We're climbing up. Now where do I go? Can I go back this way? Am I good? Did I beat it? Did I win? All right, I'm walking through still. I I'm so so curious what that is out in the distance. Like what? You guys see that? I don't know what the heck that is, bro. All right, am I free now? Did I make it out? Was I supposed to go? I want to make sure that I wasn't supposed to get... Because it seemed like kind of like a dead end in there. And I kind of just like jumped out. I don't want to mess up the game. You know what I mean? All right, here we go. Let's go back to that like lava pit area. And see what, what there is to do. Um, hmm. I don't think there was any other path for me to take. That I could see at least. Oh, unless it was this. <laughs> I don't think that I was supposed to do that, bro. Oh my goodness. I think I messed up, man. All right. Well, anyways, guys, I think that was supposed to be the end of chapter one, I'm guessing. But there's probably going to be more in the future. So thank you to this guy for making me this game. And I think there is one more scary game that I happen to see when searching my name. So let's go ahead and jump into another scary game that one of you guys have made based around me. Woo! All right, guys. So unfortunately, I am unable to play this game that was made for me. It's made for C Dang Scary by Key and Gamer. And there's a little bendy guy. And it actually looks like kind of a scary game. But unfortunately, it's not open to visitors right now. So I'm unable to play it. It says he made this game for C Dang and for everyone. Warning, do not play this game if you're not a fan of jump scares. Oh my goodness. It would have been crazy. So hopefully, Kian, you're watching this video right now and you make this available for me to play in the future. And maybe I can circle back to it and go ahead and play it. But luckily, I was able to find still one more game that one of you guys have made. Uh, it is, you might be scared of this game. And it is C Dank and his crew. If you are recording this, you are awesome. Thank you. I'm awesome now. So let's go ahead and play this game now. And let's see how scary it is right now freaking now man i really wish that other game worked but at least we were able to find one more to do guys all right here we go there's a bunch of springs everywhere the the map is a little spooky there's a, there's a lot of darkness everywhere what are they, oh that spring actually scared me and i hate to say it because it literally did oh oh god there's some kind of thing over there there's some kind of beast all right let's get in this car just to be safe all right what the heck is that thing what is that oh my goodness look at the house too blood noob oh my gosh what the heck bro it's just a pile of bodies and a blood noob. What the heck, bro? Uh-oh. Dude, I'm kind of scared of this guy. And the, the scarier thing is this house, bro. There's freaking ketchup all over the place. All right. Should I go in? All right. I'm going to go in. He's not really tracking me. He's kind of going in circles. So we're going to this house. Oh, God. There's, an, there's more blood noobs. There's ketchup all over the place, bro. This is creepy, bro. Why is everything so red? Why is everything so red? Oh, look at that painting. It's actually not that scary. <laughs> the painting's fine, actually. Blood noob, don't hurt me. Okay, that's the light. Oh my gosh, there's freaking ketchup everywhere, bro! Okay, we can't... I don't know why every time I try to go through that door, it just never works, bro. I just need to stop. Oh god, what the heck's going on in here? I do not want to go in that room. Oh my gosh, this happened in here, too! Ah! I don't want to be in here anymore. Oh god, that's gonna be the last room I go into. This door not work? Oh, there we go. We're in. Oh gosh, there's the other blood noob. Oh, I was just chilling in a freaking beanbag. Without a worry in the world. Anything in here? Dude, this theme is so creepy, actually. It's so dark. Oh god, I'm freaking scared right now. Oh, I don't know why. I, oh, they do open. Oh, okay. I always wondered why they did that, but now I know why. They do actually open. All right, now the last room. Oh god, it's another freaking blood noob, bro. Oh my goodness, bro. What do you... What do you guys even do? Do you just... Do you even kill people or you just walk around like you're a noob that's all bloody? I mean, ketchup -y. You got ketchup. You, you got too much ketchup on your freaking hot dog, bro. D down here in Chicago, you... Or I'm not even in Chicago anymore. <laughs> but in Chicago, you're not allowed to put ketchup on your hot dogs, buddy. What are you doing? What's up with that? Oh my gosh, they actually are really creepy looking, though. And I think that's it, bro. I think that was just the house. Uh, is there anything on that sign? No. And then they have the springs here. And then they had this other guy here, too. And there's just a pile of freaking bodies everywhere, man. What's up with that, bro? But anyways, guys, I think I'm going to end off there. Once again, I want to thank you guys for making me games in Roblox. It's really awesome. If you guys do want to make me a game, make sure you put the name C-Dank or C-Dank in the title or the description so that I can find it. Oh, my gosh. This house is creepy, too, even though it's just a normal house. Uh... <laughs> Make sure you guys do that. I really do appreciate you guys making me games, and I'll definitely get into playing them in the future, guys. I really do like horror games and scary games in that aspect. If you guys 
did you not know already because i play a lot of them on my channel so don't forget to slam that like button down below guys and don't forget to subscribe if you guys are new to my channel as well and i will see each and every single one of you guys in my next video bye <laughs>